Hey, what's up everybody? It's Meredith Shirk with Svelte Training and I'm so excited to give you a full body resistance band workout. I've got this resistance band that you actually use for your legs, but I use it for my arms. You can use any kind of bungee loop that you have. The tighter it is, the harder it's going to be. So if it's bigger, it's gonna be easier, meaning if it's got more circumference. So let's get into this workout. You know the deal, I'm gonna walk you through all the exercises and we're gonna do it together. All right, here we go. I've got my resistance band. This is a light band, however, it is short. So I need to use this because if I use a heavy band that's short, I'm not gonna be doing any exercise, you guys. I'm just gonna be fighting to try and even pull this. So let's walk you through all these exercises with your band. You can also do it without a band if you don't have a band. It's kind of the nice thing about this workout is you really don't need anything except for yourself. So let's do the first exercise, which is a bent, over single arm row. Kind of a mouthful, bear with me here. What I'm gonna do is put my right foot in the band, I'm gonna stagger my stance, and then I'm gonna pull with my left arm, okay? So I'm gonna bend over and I'm pulling back this way, really squeezing my shoulder down, keeping that core tight. So I'm really sucked in here, pull and then down. Pull, so you're really working the back of your arm and your shoulder. Then we're gonna switch sides, same thing, left foot. Okay, I'll do it from this way, left foot, right arm. So I'm here and I pull. And then I'm pulling this way, okay? So you wanna pull across. So you can see I'm really tight here, I'm always tight in my core. Next one is a seated knee raise. Pull up your pants, do what you gotta do. Put this around your legs. Then what you're doing is you're going to lean back and you're gonna put resistance on this band and you're going to hold it. This is a great isometric hold in your core. So notice I'm really pulling everything in here. Wanna make sure I am solid. So holding this, if this is too much for you, put your legs down and just lean back and put pressure on that, okay? Taking that big breath, just pulling everything in nice and tight. Next exercise is a kneeling bicep curl. Okay, so from here, Center on, keeping your hands in, okay? If you have a tight band like I do, what I want you to do is just do a bicep hold. So this is super tight, so I'm just gonna hold it as if I'm doing an isometric hold here, pulling, isolating my shoulders, my back, and my biceps, pulling here. If the band is not that tight, or you do it single leg, you can also pull from here and hold it straight up, set your chest, everything's in line. You wanna try to get that 90 degree angle when you're doing this, so just pulling up, and holding either way that works for you. Same thing on this side, we're doing single, chest up, pull the core in, hold that, feel the pressure right there. Big breath, then we're doing a bridge with a knee open, okay? So this is like your hip press, same goes with all the hip presses that we do, is you're pressing up, rolling your tailbone under, and then opening, closing against the resistance of the band. So from here, press up, open, close, down. But I always have pressure on the band, so it never goes loose. A little bit of pressure on the band, ground your heels up, open, down. So you're really feeling it in that outside of your butt, almost like a, like a saddlebag area, right? Like right in the saddlebag, kind of love handle, press up, down, here. Up, down, okay? Last exercise is a scissor band kick. So, so on her back, band comes down a little bit farther, okay? My hands are going underneath my butt and I'm just scissoring, okay? Definitely a difficult exercise. So I wanna make sure that you guys do this. If you need to put one leg down and you just come up with one scissor like this, totally fine. So same thing, because doing that single is, is compromising to your core. If you don't have a strong core, so you really make sure you press everything in together. Taking that breath, and that's it. That is your full body band workout. So let's get into this together. 30 seconds of the exercise, transitioning, couple rounds. This is a winner. Make sure you have your water, make sure your eyes are on me. Let's get into it. So 
First things first, 30 seconds. We're gonna go 15 seconds on each side of this one arm row, okay? Because I wanna do 30 seconds and I wanna get you through this workout quickly. So if you don't have time, you don't need time to do this. So let's put the band underneath the right foot. Okay, 15 seconds. Big breath starting in three, two, one, and pull. Really isolate that shoulder, pull. Get your balance, pull. Good, 15 seconds. So it's not a lot of time on this side. We're gonna do a few rounds here. Good, three, two, one, and hold this. Feel your core tighten up, just listen to me here. Your butt's gonna be really tight on that right side. So let's switch it up. Ready? Three, two, get your footing, one, and pull. So for me, it's a little bit different because I'm on the sand, but I'm really gonna feel it here too in this left butt cheek or your glute, right? Everyone's like, I need to work on my glutes. I'm like, you're talking about your butt. That's a fancy word for your butt. Good, three, two, one, hold, pull in the core, five, four, three, two, and release, stand. Now we're going that knee raise. So on the ground, put your feet in, take that breath. You know it's coming, and 30 seconds, and open. So just hold this here, pull your core in. Feel like you're really putting pressure against this band while at the same time flexing your core. Pull in your stomach. I had two babies that ripped apart my stomach. So if I do not do this, donut, donut, I'm see, I'm thinking about donuts. When I do not do this, my stomach gets ripped apart. So if you need to put your feet down, put them down. Don't let the pressure go. Three, two, one, hold it. Flex as hard as you possibly can while still breathing. Three, two, one, and down. Big breath, biceps, ready? curling. I'm going to go a bicep hold, 30 seconds. It's going to be tough. We're in it to win it. I'm doing this with you guys. Three, two, one, and pull and hold. So isolate, pull your shoulders back. Okay. Pull your core in. Shoulders back, core in. You don't want to do this, right? You want to pull in. So you can visibly see like when I, when I do this, it opens it up. Big breath in the nose, to the mouth. Hold it tight. Flex your arms. You should be shaking. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Now what I want you to do is tighten your butt. Flex your hamstrings, back your legs. Three, two, one, and down. Bridge separation with those knees. You know what's up, we're rolling right through this workout. Love these bands, gives you a little bit of extra. Ready, 30 seconds. Just follow my voice and up. Open, close, down. Up, open, close, down. Remember, I do not want you to take any pressure off this band, so never let it go actually like fully loose, okay? Always breathe, press the hips up, open the legs, squeeze that butt, close, down. Open, down. Up, open, close, down. You got this. Open, close, down. Five seconds, four, three, hold this now. Just hold it. Hold this, it's burning. Your butt is on fire. Down. Okay, take a big breath. We're going right into the scissors. Move it down a little bit. This is gonna be challenging. Hands underneath your butt. I wanna challenge you, ready? And up and down, 30 seconds. Take your time. Okay, pull your core in. When I don't pull my core in, you guys can see, because I have a hole in the middle of my stomach. So if I don't do it, you see that ridge that comes up? It's not good. Right? Trying to build that together. If you need to, put one foot down, go five seconds, and then switch. Okay? There's always ways that we can get around limitations of your body. Three, two, one, hold it. See if you can sit straight up. Take a breath, because we're going into round two. Take a big breath here. Here we go. Single arm. Pull, right foot, left arm, five seconds, four, three, two, and pull, pull. Really isolate that shoulder, pull. Get your balance, pull. Good, 15 seconds. So it's not a lot of time on this side. We're gonna do a few rounds here. Good, three, two, one, and hold this. Feel your core tighten up, just listen to me here. Your butt's gonna be really tight on that right side. So let's switch it up, ready? Three, 
two, get your footing, one, and pull. So for me, it's a little bit different because I'm on the sand, but I'm really gonna feel it here too in this left butt cheek or your glute, right? Everyone's like, I need to work on my glutes. I'm like, you're talking about your butt. That's a fancy word for your butt. Good, three, two, one, hold, pull in the core, five, four, three, two, and release, stand. Now we're going that knee raise. So on the ground, put your feet in, take that breath. You know it's coming and 30 seconds and open. So just hold this here, pull your core in, feel like you're really putting pressure against this band while at the same time flexing your core. Pull in your stomach. I had two babies that ripped apart my stomach. So if I do not do this, donut, donut, I'm see, I'm thinking about donuts. When I do not do this, my stomach gets ripped apart. So if you need to put your feet down, put them down. Don't let the pressure go. Three, two, one, hold it. Flex as hard as you possibly can while still breathing. Three, two, one, and down. Big breath, biceps, ready? Curling, I'm gonna go a bicep hold, 30 seconds. It's gonna be tough. We're in it to win it. I'm doing this with you guys. Three, two, one, and pull and hold. So isolate, pull your shoulders back, okay? Pull your core in. Shoulders back, core in. You don't wanna do this, right? You wanna pull in. So you can visibly see, like when I, when I do this, it opens it up. Big breath in the nose, to the mouth. Hold it tight, flex your arms. You should be shaking. Breathe in the nose, out through the mouth. Now what I want you to do is tighten your butt. Flex your hamstrings, back your legs. Three, two, one, and down. Bridge separation with those knees. You know what's up, we're rolling right through this workout. Love these bands, gives you a little bit of extra. Ready, 30 seconds. Just follow my voice and up, open, close, down. Up, open, close, down. Remember, I do not want you to take any pressure off this band, so never let it go actually like fully loose, okay? Always breathe, press the hips up, open the legs, squeeze that butt, close, down. Open, down. Up, open, close, down, you got this. Open, close, down, five seconds, four, three, hold this now, just hold it. Hold this, it's burning. Your butt is on fire, down. Okay, take a big breath, we're going right into the scissors. Move it down a little bit, this is gonna be challenging. Hands underneath your butt, I wanna challenge you, ready? And up and down, 30 seconds. Take your time, okay, pull your core in. When I don't pull my core in, you guys can see because I have a hole in the middle of my stomach. So if I don't do it, you see that ridge that comes up? It's not good, right? Trying to build that together. If you need to, put one foot down, go five seconds, and then switch, okay? There's always ways that we can get around limitations of your body. All right, this is your last set. Let it roll five seconds, four, three, two. You're not done yet, hold it. Oh my gosh, so hard. Pull in, pull in, pull in, sit up nice and tall. Take a big deep breath. Take your time getting up. Just know you killed it. And if you like these workouts, make sure you like it, share it, and leave a comment about your favorite exercise and what workout band you're using. And make sure, I'll see you guys in the next one.